Hi there, this is Alex from Alcacon Software and in this video I am going to show you a new feature of OpenCMS 9.5 which is called Nested Containers. Now Nested Containers is a very powerful feature and it allows you to create page layouts or even templates without coding. And Let me show you how this works. You see here on that example page this blue area which is called empty container. Now what I can do I can go to the menu over here and bring up the element view and switch the element view to layout and if I do that I'm getting a different content options. So this is a new feature in 9.5 as well I can group existing uh, content types to different views and in this example now I have the layout row and the layout row basically allows me to create different column layouts and drag and drop them to that container here on the page. For example I can have this two column half and half layout and drag and drop that here and then let's say I want to have a full column on top of that and maybe four columns below. So I have very easily created my layout and now I switch back to the default view where I'm getting different content options like text here. So I'm going to select one of these. Let's use that one. Here I change the element settings, selecting a different formatter for the text like the Jumbotron formatter. Okay, that looks nice. Uh, let's remove this leftovers from a previous demo with inline editing. And now I'm adding two more pieces of content, let's say icon boxes like inline edit drop this here and maybe uh, the responsive thing and drop that there and to make this look a bit more nice I bring up the settings for these and they are a bit different because they are different pieces of content so I can here select the background let's say I want an, an aqua background and a a turkey's background. So this looks nice enough for me right now and what you also have seen is that I having the edit points here for these three items I cannot edit the headline with the navigation and also not the foot area um, because these are restricted areas and right now I'm the uh, editor user now Jess, uh, I'll be logging in as a different user with more um, permissions. First I have to log off and now I'm logging in as the uh, templater user and the templater user has the template developer role and with that role I have uh, full permissions to edit all aspects of the layout I bring up the menu and now you see I have an edit point here and also down there where previously I had none. Now I'm the template user. Now what I will do is I will remove the element here on top which is a navigation element and you see uh, it's gone and I can also remove this foot element and I'm getting empty uh, layout rows. And then of course I can add a piece of content like for example um, here this one which I've already prepared. So as you can see as the template developer user I have full control over the uh, page layout. What's important to understand is that all these uh, layouting options are of course uh, optional so you don't need to create your template like that. This is just a demo template. Uh, 
actually I don't like the look of this, I'm just removing the headline altogether as well as the foot. Okay, so as I said this is uh, very very powerful and our demo we have uh, created a lot of flexibility and as you see I can uh, very easily create layouts with drag and drop and I don't have to code anything. Okay, that was uh, a brief introduction to the um, nested container feature and the layout options they bring in OpenCMS 9.5. Thank you very much attention. We have more videos of OpenCMS Online. Please come back for further information. Thank you.